Okay, this is video number one of two for um, the results on the 8800 GTs, Solo, SLI, 3D Mark 06, and Oblivion. All right, and overclocking. All right, so um, card number one. Um, now keep in mind the 8800 GTs come at a stock 600. These were manufacturer overclock to 650, and the um, memory stock is 900. The manufacturer stock is 950. The um, I would imagine it's something like 1575 or 1600 uh, stock, and these come with a 1625 on the um, on the slipstream or shaders or whatever they're called offhand. I'm not not ex exactly sure. Uh, what did I hit on card number one? 700, easy. Um, on the GPU, did I hit two gigahertz? You betcha, two gigahertz on the memory. Um, Unfortunately, uh, I tested with the NVIDIA, um, the latest uh, version of NVIDIA, uh, their drivers, and it were the stability tests. I get no stability test. Well, I mean, w when I overclock it to see if the, the overclocking is stable. That's gone. Um, bring that back. Um, the EVGA version um, doesn't have it either. Um, the version I downloaded from NVIDIA, um, like about you know two three hours ago, that didn't even have anything for SLI. So I have no clue if I was in SLI mode or not uh, after I put both cards in at the same time. So that was obnoxious, not having any clue if I had it or not. So anyway, um, so both cards hit 700. I um, and two gigahertz, no problem. Um, keep in mind that if you get the card, you might you're not guaranteed to actually overclock it that far. You might overclock it insanely far. So um, so anyway, uh, 3D Mark 06 at default settings, no overclocking, solo card. Uh, I hit 9,921 overclocked at 705 megahertz and 1,005, effectively 2 gigahertz and 10 megahertz, I hit 10,058. So yeah, you'll be able to hit 10,000 in 3D Mark 06 with the 8800 GTs. Um, and I'm sure, um, now uh, the second card I ran that at 701 megahertz and 1,001 on the overclock and I hit 10,028. So uh, as long as you can make it to about 700 slash 1,000, effectively 2 gigahertz, you should be able to hit 10,000. Um, keep in mind I've got an AMD Opteron 185 that runs stock at 2.6. It's running at uh, 2.7, what exactly here, 2.76. I don't have the multi uh, multiplier. I don't have the uh, FSB overclock that much. Uh, really um, light overclock on the CPU, but I don't think that makes that much of a difference. Two gigs of RAM, no virtual memory because why would I run virtual memory? Why would I load crap into my memory that I don't need? Um, so I'm pretty happy with that. Oblivion, um, 40 frames a second, easy. Um, and if I go to, I was hitting on the options here. With Bloom and anti-aliasing, I was getting lower frames per second than HDR. Uh, I preferred uh, the anti-aliasing and Bloom. The HDR did look pretty sweet, but it, I mean, it would be really nice if I could do HDR and anti-aliasing. Um, I was hitting about 30 frames a second on uh, with SLI, or at least that's what um, the software is telling me. Um, with uh, when I was looking out on the distance, all the shadows turned off. I have to, I'm not 100% sure I was running an SLI because the software doesn't have the option to tell me in the screenshot and the help file that it, that it was showing me or uh, on the website. It, it where's my options? So, um, so I'm happy with the hardware. The software is, yeah, it's pissing me off. Um, so anyway, um, Crisis, Fear, Counter-Strike, I'll get you guys some benchmarks on those. Um, I also have two copies of, um, 
Quake Wars enemy territory. Um, I'm going to try that out. The trick or treaters are going to be coming in about an uh, hour and a half. So uh, I'll probably get um, some of the scores done and then um, we'll pr I'll try to get this posted online by midnight. So um, versus my 7900 GT, I'm happy, very happy. Um, power, I was in oblivion and my on my 500 watt uh, power supply, it said 600 <laughs> all the way across. Uh, again, I don't know if I was an SLI or not. Um, so, uh, but I didn't have any problems in the game, so I will um, do more investigation on that. I'm hitting between, with both cards in there, between 350 and 400 idle with just running the video and a few programs in the back line like um, Firefox. So, uh, kind of interesting. Uh, I think I will, probably in about a month or so, upgrade the, um, the power supply uh, just to be sure. But I'm going to have to do some reading on that. So, But I'm pretty happy, and I'll get you guys those uh, further benchmarks soon. So thanks for watching, and I uh, get those video that uh, second video up as soon as I can. And uh, any other suggestions, and I'll be happy to download. I'm going to be doing just demos though, so uh, I'm not a huge gamer, but I can get you guys some benchmarks. See you soon.